Big game. Uh, yeah, they're all big now, really. Uh, but uh, the last time you went to Kansas City, you guys managed to uh, to really hammer out a, a good point after being down and down to ten men. Yeah, obviously a very difficult game when you when you go to um, Kansas City. But um, considering the last game when we didn't play that well, but we still managed to get ourselves a point that, that obviously gives us a lot of optimism going into it, and especially the last couple of away performances as well, where we where I think we've deserved both both victories. So um, we know it will be very tough, um, but we know we can we can get a lot of confidence from it. Seeing Kansas City on the schedule get the blood boiling a bit after what happened last time out? Oh no, 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 not at all. It's just a it's just another game for us. It's another game for us to try and get you know better and, and try and. Um, you know, uh, uh, get better as a team, and especially you know, learn from these these games when you when you play away from home. Especially teams like Kansas City, you know, you want to get something out of every single game you play, and, and you can learn. So it, it benefits you, um, you know, down the down at the end. They're coming off a loss. How important is it to jump on them early? Well, they'll be saying the same thing. So you know, they'll want a reaction from um, from coming off a loss. So. Um, you know, we, we will just take care of our own business and um, I, I bet you they'll take care of theirs and we'll see what happens. Uh, you guys have had a, quite a successful road trip so far, six out of nine points. If I told you going in that that'd be the case, would you be satisfied? Yeah, I think so. I think, you know, especially in this league, wins away from home are, um, you know, really valuable. And and we've got, you know, we're, we're in the positive when it comes to away performances at the moment, which is which is a bit different for this club. So, so that's a nice... Um, Statistic that we that we like, um, and we want to we want to improve upon it. Looking at the table, you guys have two games in hand on Kansas City. If you're going to catch them, this game is a must-win. I think so. I think so. I think you're right. Or even a draw. I think we just can't lose them. Um, in 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 terms of potentially trying to catch them, if we draw them and then you know win or take four points from the next two games, it's it's pretty close. You know, with a few games left. So. So we just can't we can't lose to them if we want to catch them. But in saying that, you know, um, you know, we, we, we're we more than confident that we can get a result. And if we don't get a result, we're more than confident um, moving ahead. Bit of a bit of a bug going through the the team. A couple of guys are sick. Uh, you know, hoping that they kind of get Daniel leaving. I, I, Chris said he got something maybe on the flight. Kanapka, uh, are some of the guys battling? Yeah, four or five have gone down actually um, over the past five or six days. So. Um, Yes, we're, we're a bit thin, you know, especially with Bloomy and Stephen um, um, not available. We, we may have Jermaine back, which mm -hmm. is, um, but again, we don't want to push him too much. Um, so, yeah, we've got a few guys down and a few, a few carrying a bit, but, um, but again, we're, we've got a big enough squad to hopefully be able to handle it. What is Jermaine's status at this point? His status is that he's um, it's looking positive, looking really good, so, um, yeah, he might be available. Any update on Bloom or Caldwell? Um, I think it's probably just a game too early for those two. Okay.